Arnell from Arnell's Everyday English and I'm going to help you understand the difference between so and such. There are only four simple steps to understanding the difference between these two words. My lesson plan for today is so such comparing so and such so such that a very important structure okay that looks nice and easy let's continue so so means very of course so has a lot of other definitions but today if we're comparing it with such it means very we use so plus adjective or adverb oh, this food looks so good i have so plus my adjective good This man was playing the violin so beautifully. Not like me. I have so plus my adverb beautifully. Let's do another one. This is so weird. I have so plus my adjective weird. Okay, we can also use so plus many or much plus a noun. When do I use many? When do I use much? I use many with countable nouns and much with uncountable nouns. What's a countable noun? What's an uncountable noun? A countable noun has a singular and a plural form. Dog, dogs, hat, hats, person, people. These are all countable nouns used with many. Uncountable nouns do not have a singular or a plural form. There's one form. I drink a lot of water not waters it's information never informations there's only one form okay nicole why do you drink so much coffee so much plus an uncountable noun <sighs> i'm under so much pressure at work so much plus uncountable noun. Brian, why, why do you own so many stuffed animals? So many plus countable noun? When I went to LA, I met so many wonderful people. So many plus countable noun people. As you can see in the last two examples, I have an adjective in the middle, but that's okay. It's very important to understand if you use so many so much, you must have a noun. Let's move on to such. Okay, it's such plus noun. Normally an adjective goes in between. Why do I have a and n? In parentheses, use a and an if your noun is a singular noun. If it's a plural noun or uncountable noun, do not use a or an. <clears throat> Yesterday was such a beautiful day. If you want to sound more natural, try to make such and a uh one sound. Such a, such a, such a. Yesterday was such a beautiful day. My students put on such an amazing performance. 
again, if you want to sound more natural, combine such an, such an, such an, such an. My students put on such an amazing performance. Why do I use a? Why do I use an? We use a before a consonant sound and an before a vowel sound. My son is being such a little monster today. Oh. You know, when I was a teenager, I never appreciated it, but I had such patient parents. Here, why don't I have a uh, or an? Because parents is a plural noun. So, let's look at so and such side by side. Okay, I'm always so hungry. I have such a big appetite. So plus adjective, such a plus that noun. <sighs> I'm so sick today. <clears throat> I have such <clears throat> a bad cold. A cold's a virus. So plus adjective, such a plus noun, cold. My brother always uses so much toilet paper. My brother always uses such much toilet paper. Remember, if you want to use much or many, you need to use so. You cannot use much or many with such. When I went to Rome, I took so many great pictures. So many plus my noun. Okay, let's break this down. So, here are the grammar points we discussed. We have so plus adjective, so many much plus noun, such plus noun. We're going to add that. We use this grammar to give a result. B happens because A happened. Yesterday, I was so tired that I went to bed at eight. This happened, so this happened. Why did I go to bed at eight? Because I was so tired. I was so angry that I couldn't breathe. This happened and then this happened. Why couldn't I breathe? Because I was so angry. There were so many people on the bus that I decided to walk. Why did I decide to walk? Because there were so many people on the bus. My neighbor is such a nice lady that I decided to bake her cookies. Why did I bake her cookies? Because she's such a nice lady. Okay, that's everything. You've done an excellent job. If you want to see more mini lessons and videos, don't forget to subscribe and I can't wait to see you soon.